A 25-year-old black man goes missing in the state of Illinois and then is found dead. And no one seems to know about it, including me. So, let's make his story as public as possible. This is the case of Jelani Day. Jelani was actually working towards his medical degree, specifically in speech pathology, and this was at Illinois State University. Jelani's mother, Carmen Bolden Day. By the way, ma'am, if you happen to see this video, I, I really hope that it does help in some way. She described her son as someone that just everyone loved to be around. He was caring, he was fun, extremely sociable. He was described as a leader and very, very resilient. At 7.20 a.m. on August 24th, 2021, Jelani would be seen walking into this building. From what I can tell, it's a store called Beyond Slash Hello. Um, I think it is a dispensary. And this was in Bloomington, Illinois. These are the last known images of Jelani because August 24th, 2021 is the last day anyone saw him. Concern from his family grew when he did not show up for any of his classes for several days. The police would describe it as Jelani disappeared under unexplained, suspicious circumstances. A couple of days after he was reported missing, they actually found Jelani's uh, 2010 Chrysler 300, and it appeared to be concealed in some kind of like wooded area. So police searched that entire area for Jelani, but they came up with nothing. They used search dogs, they used aerial searches, search by foot, nothing. Suspiciously, it appeared that the license plates were removed off of his car. That, to me, is extremely strange. Then, on September 4th, 2021, a body was found face down in the Illinois River, and this was located in Peru, Illinois. 19 days later, that body was identified as Jelani Day. There was misinformation given out about his remains. Someone leaked a report that like he had organs missing from his body, but his family went out publicly and said no, everything was there. In terms of his cause of death, we don't know. They are still awaiting toxicology reports, so they don't really know his cause of death yet. But police need your help. If you live in this area, did you see Jelani Day? If you have any information about his case, please contact Detective Jones at 309-434-2548. I know his name isn't Gabby Petito or Brian Laundrie. His name is Jelani Day. Let's make sure everyone knows it. Capiche?